Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. Um, contrary to what I'm wearing, this video is not about Russell Athletic, but this is something I recently found from one of the past collaborations that I did with Nordstrom. And that time they were carrying Russell Athletics and I had to wear it because it's pink and I actually have like three of these shirts in different colors. Anyways, I'm sidetracking, that's not the video about. You guys know I have done actually I think two videos about Clarence products and I absolutely love this brand because I think they have such high quality products and they are really really effective. Uh, I will link them up here. Uh, I have done one with Clarence like I think uh, body oil and uh, like a scrub and I have also done the Clarence that, that's like a scrub for face and also the mask. It was so good. Uh, I actually finished most most of them actually already. I think the only thing that's left is that the oil. I 100% recommend those products. So today I am trying specifically Clarence Men. So this is essentially like a sub brand of Clarence uh, and just only for men. So these are two products here. It is Clarence Man Energizing Gel uh, and also Energizing Gel, uh, Energizing Eye Gel. So one is for your face and one is for your eye area. So we're gonna test these out. I have been trying them for the couple of past days, so just to see how they are. First thing I'm gonna start is this actual, the big energizing gel. So this thing, first thing I like about like, not a big fan of the color uh, for the packaging or anything, but one thing I love is that like, Packaging is so cool because I think when you're traveling and everything and like it's important that like it doesn't get broken But also you don't lose the product also you don't use too much product Because when you have like pump or anything It's easier to not use too much product because it tells you how much you need So this is essentially like this because when you are just twisting it It's open and you can just Put it you guys see so it's like I got like three pumps now and you can just apply it very easily and it dries super fast it's not like greasy or anything it smells pretty good so that's one thing i'm going to say almost both of these products have very similar ingredients um because it's like sub brand of them it's just different slightly uh so they have both red ginseng extract I'll put it here, I might be butchering the name, but this is essentially like a plant that really helps with your hydration in your face, uh, lacks in that hydration, uh, because I think over time as we get older, it's very important that like we have, we get hydration for our face because we are not getting like, we are not getting as much like moisture as we used to get. It's just the way we are, I guess, you know, <laughs> like part of uh, growing up. <laughs> they say so anyways yeah um and this is like that's the reason i'm actually doing this in the morning because i want to show you guys like how rough i look and i'm gonna apply actually this energizing gel so i'll show you guys so because they are just selling this as like a you know this is energizing gel but this is not like a because at first from my understanding, I just really thought this was a serum because you know, gel, serum, they're kind of like a very similar texture, but this is not a serum. This is essentially like a moisturizer, but in a moisturizer in a very gel format um, because it's not like your typical moisturizer that's like cream cream. This is kind of like a liquidy, very similar to like a serum, but not exactly serum. So it's like between serum uh, and moisturizer. So that's that. Another thing I would say, because I saw it in the comments someone was saying is, is that, so this big one uh, has alcohol actually. Um, I'm gonna probably say this, that's, I mean this thing is, this is totally fine with me because I haven't really seen any reaction in my face or in my hand at all. Um, I have used this like a bunch of times now, so nothing at all. I have also tried it with my boyfriend, nothing. Um, but I do see why that's happening, like why some people are not happy about it, but I have to be honest with you guys, and I have noticed this with so many brands. Most luxury brands, I don't know if this is like a marketing thing or it's just the way people want to buy because they want to feel luxurious. They just have alcohol, meaning most of them have actually fragrance in it. It just maybe because of the experience that like you know when you're using it you're like wow it smells so good and like it's luxurious it's expensive 
I don't know, maybe it's because of that, because it doesn't really do a purpose in terms of, you know, why would you need to add a fragrance to it? There's literally no purpose uh, besides just like to making it smell nicer. Um, that's the only downside to it. Personally, I don't mind it because it's not like super strong or anything that it lingers. Um, but I can see for some people who have sensitive skin that they would be not happy about it. So just want to warn you guys about that. But this one is only for the energizing gel. So I'm going to double check again to see because they almost pretty much have the same ingredients just to see if the eye gel has the alcohol in it or like any sort of fragrance because I would not recommend anything that has alcohol to put on uh, under your eyes because let's be honest because our skin is already sensitive, right? Like not super sensitive, but like they're pretty strong but sensitive. This eye area is very sensitive. That's why like when you apply, when you need to apply something to your eyes, before you do it, apply it somewhere else in your skin and if you're fine, then you can apply it to your eyes. But, speaking of that, so let's get into this one. So I like this product a lot because I, there are a lot of eye creams, they just like, it's like a cream and you apply it yourself. But I recommend most eye gels or eye creams that you get, Again, not recommend eye creams overall, but if you need to, uh, get the ones that have metal head on it. Not plastic one like Kylie Skin that they sell it, because plastic is not gonna do anything good. And worst case, it's actually gonna cause infection on your skin, so probably you shouldn't get it. But this one has metal. You know when, uh, I remember when I was a kid, I think it was my mom or my grandma was telling me that like, you should put a spoon on your, like, under eyes. Uh, in case you have black circles or dark circles or whatever so it will really help and spoon is made out of metal so this is essentially the same thing so it's like a cold metal that's really helps with energizing your skin and it's like it has such a cooling effect on top of that it has serum in it well serum i mean formula so when you apply it so this is what it looks like it literally looks like a shaving part but it's so cooling and you just press it a little bit and it just apply it. Honestly, even if it didn't have a formula, just putting it by itself, it is so cooling. I 100% recommend it. You don't necessarily have to get this to do this, but I'm just saying this literally has a similar effect as like putting a spoon into the freezer, then taking it out and putting it in your eyes. Literally the same effect, but except this one has formula too, so it really helps with dark circles and everything but on top of it so it's like extra effective but it's just so cooling to have you know formula and uh, this metal head I will have to give like 10 out of 10 for that because metal hearts are so effective especially in eye gel so because I don't generally recommend like eye creams or anything but because this has this I mean it's really effective like who wants to carry a spoon with themselves let's be honest you know or if you don't have like clean spoon <laughs> i don't know uh, but anyway so i'm just saying like it's really effective i recommend it i'm gonna try to find to see if they have like different effect to it but this also has red ginseng extract so you can definitely use it so they both really help with the moisture and lock locking your hydration in uh it really helps a lot with dark circles if you're you know struggling with that um I would personally say I like the eye gel better than this one. Um, there's nothing against it, but I'm just, I just not prefer like super gel format for moisturizer. That's just my personal preference, but that's just it. And thank you so much for Clarence sending me these two products. I'm gonna link them down below and so you guys can check them out and prefer to see which one you wanna buy. So thank you guys for watching this and I'll see you guys next week. Bye guys.